Hey guys, it's Christina Andino with the Jasinski Home Team at Baird & Warner and I am out here in front of one of our listings at 9720 West 58th Street in Countryside. And I'm out here today because I want to chronicle this little piece of Countryside history for you because it's going to be changing hands in a week or so. And um, this house was built in the 1940s. It was one of the first houses in Countryside. And I just wanted to chronicle this for everybody um, you know, before new owners take over. So come along with me and I'm gonna give you a little, a little tour here of the property. In 1947, Cheryl and Helen Lynch bought an acre of land for $1,000 in Countryside, which was at the time a fruit orchard. Cheryl worked days at Electromotive on 55th and East Avenue as a time study engineer. And during the evenings, and weekends began building a small two-bedroom cottage, eventually moving Helen and their two children in and beginning to homestead the land. They had organic gardens, kept bees to make honey, and had 500 evergreens for sale. These efforts fed the family and produced income. Five to six years later, Cheryl began to build what would come to be known as the Big House. This would be around 1955. This was a three bed, one bath ranch. And at the time, this would be one of maybe five houses in all of Countryside. The roads were gravel and the old ideal school was located at Joliet and East Avenue next to a small Piper Cup airport known as Stinson Airport along East Avenue. By 1958, the whole family moved into the big house. And although Cheryl had intended to make the cottage into a two-car garage once the big house was completed. That didn't happen. They ended up renting it out, which was permissible then and provided additional income. Many people may not know that Cheryl and Helen were actually amateur photographers and went on to travel extensively and become judges in the field. Cheryl was also very involved in the Countryside Homeowners Association in the 1950s. The last structure completed was the garage, which was big enough for a car and an Airstream trailer affectionately named Trilly. Cheryl and Helen lived in the 5700 block of 58th Street well into their 90s. And now, after all these years, new owners are beginning a new chapter in this one of the first homes built in Countryside. Thank you so much to Janet and Barbara Lynch for providing me with the story of this wonderful and significant home in Countryside.